got me out here walking. I'm about to take this dark trail and this jump past the time I'm supposed to be walking back here. I don't know. Just thought I'd get out here and get a little walking. By the time I come up that other hill, I'm gonna be done. Then my foot was hurting. Sprang that jaw. Got tape on it right now. Can't see it. I think if I tried to show you, you probably still couldn't see it, but it's kind of blending with the sock. But see, that's just uh athletic part of me. Active. Just gotta be out here doing something. It's really not that dark though. Besides, like this, this will really test it. I got me some different sneakers on than I had when I sprang them jumps though. Had them, had them Air Max 720s on. They ain't got no ankle support, right? None. So walking out my mom's house, stepped on like that side of the grass where they try to, this dirt, and then you got that top part, this grass. Tweaked that jump right there. As soon as I did it, I jumped up so I ain't get it no deep, get it deep in there. I said, ah. Oh. Limped around for a good hour and a half. Came back, went through my mom's stuff. You know, she always got some medical stuff up there in her room. Got me that athletic tape. What? Started rapping like a personal trainer. <sighs> Now it's kind of cool right now. I'm chilling with that job. Could I play ball? Hell yeah. Without the athletic tape, I would try. But that job would be crucial though. Definitely crucial. <clears throat> On a bad ankle though, eat the honey. I probably still play big basketball with this pandemic. Nigga can't get out and do nothing. Take this, take this long walk. The bushes look extra bushy. Everything out there looks ridiculous. Just so you can see it ain't it ain't dark, but it's it's getting trust and believe it get real. They gonna say that for two time. It's gonna look for two to these niggas around here, I'll tell you that. <laughs> so all that's so all that's gonna matter. As long as it look like a four two. <laughs> the giddy up is quick. Got this stinky creek over here. Oh no. Think about it. Maybe. Probably now. Why oh, people always think you gotta go back in time? It's probably people bathing in that in other country right now. Shoot. I wish I would. Am I, you know what? I ain't gonna say that. I would though, cause I ain't a dirty nigga. I, so what you saying is you would rather not get in no water than some half dirty water. <laughs> That's how you gotta look at it. I feel them. I would've did the same thing, bro. I would've did the same thing. I just like walking back here, man. I bring the kids back here sometimes. 
Just that noise, man. I swear to God, if I was a basketball player, football player, pre-game would be me walking back here every, 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 uh, like a pre-game ritual. Like, you just hear that noise, the birds, the breeze, the trees. Bruh, that's when I turn into an animal in the field, just like something out here. You feel me? That's what it do. That's what it do to me. Just give it a moment of silence right there. But yeah, though. If you ain't noticed, got the Sixers jersey on. If you couldn't see who it was, you know what I mean? You know, no other than the one, the only, Ben Simmons. You know what I'm saying? It's been, been a minute since I bought a jersey, but when I say I, I ain't follow no player, like, if whoever, like, follow, like, LeBron since high school or any player, you know, to be, you know, to be less specific and that bull you following since high school middle school i mean and the and the idea that he landed on the team that i am a huge fan of i had to right when i say the first opportunity that i had like it was like you know how you just come across some some extra cash and it just happened to be enough it was nothing else i was thinking about but that and I was like, yeah, I'm about to get that. Got it. I don't wear it a lot. I only wear it like sometimes. It was a time where I was wearing it heavy, but I try to like chill with it. But it's another one I'm trying to get. That 70, 76 or something to say on there. 70. I don't know. I'm trying to get that. You know, I like that. That white and red. They got a couple jerseys I still get. Personally, I get that old school stuff with Simmons on it. So when I play 2K, I be getting that old school black John, the A I used to wear, and I put six on that. I mean, put two five on that. That look nice, cause on the back, you remember Kyle Corbett that sharp 26, 25 look nice on that. If I could get that in real life to wear, knowing I like wearing black, oh. Say no more. Say no more. Say no more. Say less. Come on now. That's a couple Sixers jerseys. Then you got the old school Sixers Jones. You know. Man, it's crazy. It's funny though. Like, I think Toronto Raptors got the best jerseys like all time. Really hard to argue with some of their jerseys. Like them Jones was vicious. I remember just playing with the Raptors just so I could play in those jerseys. Having my creative player go to the Raptors. My mom player. Them jerseys sick. Put a little Raptor on there. They used to have some crazy Jones in back in the day. People don't even young bulls don't even know. I like that the NBA be trying to regenerate them Jones somewhat, but they always trying to throw something new down. Hey. I mean. I, Nice though. They had some old school joints. It was crazy. Like, and knowing the way kids like to dress now, flashy, all the colors, bruh, you can get jiggy with the, with the, with the fit with that. Straight up turning up. I'm telling you, man, it's not meant for me to have a lot of money because. My closet would look like Chris Browns. I'm telling you, man. The way I, I don't really have like a specific, like, oh yeah, that's what he would wear. You can't nobody. If you know me, you wouldn't even be able to say, oh yeah, that's what Omar. Omar, I got so many different things I like to wear. Come out there with that Morris chestnut shit, or like what I'm wearing now. Do ragged up. Something. Don't let me get the suit out. Looking presidential on y'all. Why? It's crazy, bro. Do 
so much. I would do so much. I need to be like, yeah, you would never dress the kids nice. Have my son in. I ain't even no label person, but having this fly polo stuff. Won't even have to be polo. I know all the good quality places people don't even know nothing about. Just have my son looking sharp as some, some, some silk. Like DJ Khaled's son. See, now, when you say daughter, I ain't got nothing for you. I ain't got nothing for you. I wouldn't know where to start. But I definitely keep it simple though. They had jerseys that couldn't even find, find them. Only ones you could find, probably like the, uh, I'm trying to think, old school ones. Everybody like wearing the Jordan. That's a classic. You don't really be seeing a lot of people wearing it, but it's a classic, John. Ron seemed like he he becoming a classic John now. That Cleveland John. Some of them Cleveland jerseys was tough. 06, 07, 08. Miami definitely has some tough, tough jerseys. See, it's all about what flavor you got with color, but if you if you got if you got any style style, you you like you like anything that look fly. Like it's not even about uh cause because you could have something be like Moss green and the joint be just straight tough. You be like, I don't even like moss green, but like they you get some moss green 11s, you know what I'm saying? With the suede, you don't even like moss green. But Jordan dropped some moss green joints, Yeezy dropped Yeezy, definitely dropped some moss green. So he liked them, uh, pastel type colors. I'm starting to get winded as I'm walking. This the this the final scratch though. Once I get up this hill, it's over. Get back in the car. Pull over. to the sun, but it's like the moon now. I feel my chest pounding. See, I'm too dark to be turning my head around. People can't even see where my nose was at. 